GER Detect in cooperation with UIG Detectors presents to you a detailed guidance on how to use 3D GER Viewer on Android system. First, turn on the tablet device or the cell phone. Then connect the main unit to the tablet device via Bluetooth. Tap the Bluetooth icon. Bluetooth will search for devices near your tablet. Then the Deep Seeker Bluetooth appears. Click on it. A window will appear to enter the password, which is 1000. Press OK to complete the pairing operation between the tablet and the main unit. Close the window and run GER 3D Viewer program. A list of several languages will appear. German, English, French, Italian, Spanish, Arabic, Portuguese and Russian. After selecting the English language, Select Device menu will appear. Choose the device. Example, Deep Seeker. The program will connect to the device. A connected sign will then appear. Press the Next button to go to Scan Settings menu, which consists of Scan Direction. It is to select the scanning method during scanning process, and there are two methods of scanning. Either scan in one direction, or two-way scanning, back and forth. Number of lines, to determine the number of lines within to search. Number of steps for each line to determine the images within one line. Then, press OK. Walk in consecutive steps at a distance of 30 cm between every two steps. Taking into account keeping a 30 cm distance from the first line while scanning backwards, alongside pressing the scanning button for each step. During the scanning process, a 3D image of the target being imaged will appear on the tablet screen. This image consists of a grid of squares indicating the number of steps and lines that have been scanned. Example, we have a grid of lines consisting of three columns and 10 steps per column, which means three lines of scan and each line consists of 10 images captured. The following parameters will appear on the image. The depth of the target in the ground, the value, to view the depth, press the View Depth icon. To reduce image height, use the minus plus icons of the image in blue color. The two red icons are used to make the image clearer and reduce the mineral salts surrounding the minerals and cavities as well as bring the image closer to geometric formation. 3D icon. It enables you to shift from the 2D to the 3D mode and vice versa. To open an image previously saved, click on the open icon and then press the photo itself. To save the image in a format that can be analyzed later, click on the save icon. To save the image in a PNG format, click on Save icon. To reset the image to default, click on the Reset icon. To hide and or show grid lines, click on the Grid icon. To zoom in or out, touch and drag the photo. Moving to the image captured, it is divided into four colors as follows. Red color, 
for metals, yellow color for mineral salts, green color for soil, blue color for cavity, light blue color for the rocks surrounding the cavities. You can change colors from the settings where you will find several ready styles. Note, changing colors does not affect the analysis or results. The values in every image are interpreted as follows. All squares of red color will have close values with slight differences. If two squares have values by a large difference, i.e. 20 to 30 points, this indicates that one of these squares is metal and the other one is mineral salts with high concentration. This means that the higher value is for the metal and the lower value is for the mineral salts. For example, if we have two squares in red color, the first square value is 120 and the second square value is 140. The one at a value of 140 refers to metal and the square at a value of 120 refers to mineral salts. These criteria also apply to cavities, i.e. If two squares are shown in blue with varying values by a large difference, 20 to 30 points, this indicates that one of these squares is a cavity and the other one is a rock. This means that the higher value is a cavity and the lower value is a rock. 